And we're and we're back. Today we're talking about user feedback that we've gotten from everyone who's been using African stock photo so far. This is really important for a company that's at our stage of its development. Yeah. So we're gonna step through some of the stuff we've heard from you guys and respond to some of it, laugh at some of it. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Okay, so one of the pieces of feedback we've been getting is people struggling to give us feedback because they can't see how to contact us. And this is just a silly mistake we made in the layout of the site. In the footer, there is a contact us link, but instead of saying contact us, which is what everyone looks for, it says the, African stock photo. Yeah, and, and that's just something we can correct quite easily. And thanks for pointing it out. It will be fixed. It's up. So we recently also had a lady who um, was struggling to search for images on our website. And it turns out she was actually on the company site and not on the African stock photo web app. So that's another thing we're going to have to look into. Yeah, uh, well, there is a place, there needs to be a place for us to put our blog and company related information that's maybe not relevant enough to be on our main homepage. And we found that they're actually competing for attention at the moment. When you search for African stock photo, you might end up on our company website. And so that's something we need to think about, go back to the drawing board and we'll be fixing it soon. Uh, next, Dicky got some feedback from a user who was struggling with a low resolution iconography on the site and it was very concisely delivered. Maybe you can read that out. Yeah, it was, dude, the logo on your site, lol. So we recognize that we don't have retina imagery on certain parts of the site. This because I built it on a non retina MacBook from back in the day. Yeah. We're going to fix that. Thanks for the feedback. Lol. <laughs> <laughs> in the end, I will just say stock photo website is a great idea, but because of several reasons, I don't think anyone can crack it for Africa. So, as much as we value all the feedback we're getting and we try our best not to be defensive just because there are questions or problems that people see that we can't directly answer. Some of the feedback we get like that is kind of hard to, to you know, stomach or take at face value. Yeah. Yeah. So, so I mean, yeah. Thanks. But I'll say one other thing, like the the difference between entrepreneurs and regular people is their ability to see opportunity, where others are seeing just like chaos and pain. So, yeah. Yeah. I, I think. Dicky and I and most of the people who are watching an African stock photography company's vlog all kind of reject the idea that any business cannot be done for Africa. And so at the core of it, that's the whole point. Stock photography for Africa Happens. is the whole point. So we're going to build this company. We hopefully will convince people that this is a viable business yeah. and a product that people want to use. Yeah. So thanks for your feedback. Uh, so the next one is, I went through your website and it is very basic. So this actually is, is not offensive to us, that's the whole point. Uh, we built a, what we call an MVP, a minimal viable product, which means something that can get us started and does everything that it needs to, but might not have all the bells and whistles to make it the absolute perfect customer experience. Yeah. And that's because we don't know what the absolute perfect customer experience is exactly. yet. So yeah, the basic point is that we have built this thing, but the only way we're going to not perfect it, but move towards perfection is by getting valuable feedback and then adjusting our direction accordingly. Yeah, we, we'd be fooling ourselves if we said from the beginning that we had all the ideas and knowledge in our minds to build a perfect stock photography website yeah. when neither of us has built a stock photography website before. Yeah. So that, that's the whole point of this exercise and why we've told you today and before that we really value your feedback yeah. and we will respond to these things. We're going to make the changes that we've mentioned and make the app easier for everyone to use and hopefully a bit less basic. <laughs> We were called basic. Basic. Sour. All right. Uh, so keep the feedback coming. If you want to weigh in with your own thoughts, observations on everything we've discussed so far, or other things you've noticed when using the site, yeah. ideas on how to grow the site and our user base, hit us up. More than welcome. You can just email info at africanstockphoto.com or either one of our names at africanstockphoto.com. Yeah. Look forward to hearing. Oh, well, of course, just leave it in the comments as well. Or in the comments, yeah. So yeah, I mean we're vloggers and we're telling people to email us. <laughs> it's not good. Actually, don't email us. <laughs> Leave it Put in the, the comments. comments. Yeah. Thanks. Cheers.
we, we know what we're doing. <laughs> All right. Recording. Hi. How can you look at Now, are we going to have outtakes for the beer? <laughs> of course. It's already recording, so yeah. <laughs>